Okay, this is the AP with the foam boards. Um, let me shut this off so that we can hear. These are two nebulizer machines. They're for administering uh, breathing medicine, but uh, I got these in scrap, so they're uh, they're being used for something else now. Um, this is a uh, this is a 55 gallon drum. It's uh, about a third full of uh, copper chloride. It's very dark, very dark. And I got these two hoses run off in it for air supply. Um, so far, so far, this is this is what I've gotten out of it so far. It's uh, it's kind of hard to see, but it's it's pretty thick. pretty thick uh, gold in here and this will be uh, rinsed and then washed in hydrochloric um, this is a one gallon colander and uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna guess as to how much it may be in it but uh, I filtered this out earlier today and uh, <clears throat> replaced all the, uh, the acid because there was still a lot of boards in there that had gold on them. Um, this is just this is probably two thirds of the gold out of the just the foils off of the boards. And uh, like I said, I don't know how thick this is, but we'll find out once I wash it. Uh, I'll wash it in some water, then I'll wash it again in hydrochloric before I dissolve it. But uh, I'll turn these back on, and we'll we'll look at it bubble for a minute. That's a lot of air. That's a lot of air cooling in there. Um, I'm going. I'm going to filter it again um, here before too much longer. I'll probably let it run for the rest of the night and then filter it again in the morning. Hopefully, all the boards will be completed, be completely stripped by then. Uh, we'll add to the foils that I have now. I've got the incinerator running and, and whatever comes out of there will be run through AR after I separate out the, the steel and, and wash out some of the ash. So uh, that's the process so far. And it's looking pretty good. Everything's going fine. Uh, it's just the chemical part processes now. And uh, it's, it's moving right along. <laughs> 